Welcome back to the channel guys. Uh, in today's episode we will be looking at uh, refreshing this uh, brake booster. Uh, before I took it off the car nothing was really wrong with it. It's in a perfect operating condition. However, we can see that there's some uh, some rust, uh, surface rust spots, uh, probably from uh, splashing the brake uh, fluid. Uh, we can see also there's some uh, surface rust on top here. Nothing major, we'll clean it up. Um, I have also bought a new gasket, uh, so when it goes back onto the car we can replace it. Other than that, uh, we need to source a new uh, vacuum line here, because I had to cut this one when taking it off uh, the car. And that is pretty much it, so let's uh, clean it up, uh, clean up the surface rust, treat it, uh, scuff everything up and uh, give it a nice coat of uh, black paint, uh, so we can put it back onto the car. Let's do that now. So uh, we have cleaned it up with the wire wheel as best as we can, uh, original part ATE. Uh, turned out uh, quite well, I have to say so myself. Uh, next thing we will apply some uh, rust uh, eater and I think there is uh, a bit of surface rust in a pinch over there. Uh, I think I'll apply a bit of um, rust converter. We'll leave it to do its magic for 24 hours and uh, basically that will be it. We'll be ready for paint. Uh, so we'll do that uh, afterwards. So let's continue and apply the rust eater and see how it turns out. Sorry guys, I forgot to click record, uh, but as you can see here we have uh, applied the first coat of uh, zinc uh, spray on the exposed metal areas. Uh, we'll wait for it to dry, uh, flatten it, primer it, and then we'll give it a nice coat of uh, black uh, engine paint. Turned out good, I'm quite happy, so let's continue here.
there we have it guys the brake booster is uh, primed in um, this is anti-rust uh, primer red one uh, so yeah let's uh, wait till it's dry and then we'll flatten it and uh, give it a nice coat of black paint it turned out really nice I'm quite happy so yeah um, I used a lot of heat gun because it's uh, quite cold here it's around 12 degrees uh, Celsius so not ideal but what can I do so yeah let's continue And there you have it guys, uh, it finally is dry, uh, it turned out amazing, um, I'm quite excited uh, to put it back onto the car. Uh, you can still see a little bit where the old paint was uh, taken off, the transition, but uh, I'm not too bothered about it. The overall uh, result is very nice, the paint is smooth, um, we have untaped it, I have installed the rubber grommet, so basically this thing is ready to go back onto the car and uh, I can't wait to put it back on. Um, other than that, uh, this will be the end to this video guys, thanks for watching, uh, hit that like button, consider subscribing, and uh, I'll see you next time uh, with another one. Thanks and bye bye. <laughs>